you will at the very least see the end result and um, wow bye camera <laughs> This is my third attempt to go to physio in three weeks and every time she postponed the date or the appointment I really do hope that today I can finally get my appointment my scheduled appointment otherwise I think I'm going crazy <laughs> also this is possibly one of the first really nice days in I don't know a week or two it's still cold as fox but at least there's some sun and not just clouds and fog like it is every time here at the lake not too nice it's shaping up nice um, I went to training yesterday I don't know if I actually want to talk about it it wasn't it was interesting not because of my knee but stairs but because of another factor um, or other factors <sighs> yeah let's not talk about that I filmed actually but there was not really much to fuck the door was open and I hear her voice so at least at least she's here. Yay! <laughs> it's right there. So this is the room I spent a lot of time in over the past month. Not so much over the past three weeks, but yes. Since then, isn't it neat? I will be so glad once this is over. Hates me! <laughs> also, at least I'm not alone. I have this guy. He must have done something very bad. He has to look at the wall. Like in school when he did something stupid and he had to stand in the corner. He's a dunce or deuce or whatever it is. Also wrapping my awesome Soko Frito t-shirt. Yay! I wish they would still exist. We're done, or I'm done, and now I'm really colorful. Isn't it pretty? Not really. Seriously, blogging in public is so weird. Um, yeah, video update. Um, she says it's good. I was officially promoted to um, a status where I don't have to come regularly, um, just for checkups and for. Yeah, seeing how everything develops. Let's say I was promoted to development status. <laughs> so, all good. My balance is good. The knee is good. Everything is good. Everything is peachy fine. This camera is very dark, even though it's loud. Oh, whatever. So I can properly prepare myself for the weekend. ACW. I don't know if this will be part of it or if I will split it up kind of because tomorrow I have something else planned that is wrestling related but not directly I'm trying to get my hands on a course for speaking on camera we'll see how that works out if it will make it easier for me to interact with this beauty here and I'm out of focus again yeah also maybe I should look for a course <laughs> on how to handle this Nikon camera so I can finally show my face and not just a shadow we'll see on my way back home from work um, Today's the day where I have this little wrestling related, not wrestling related thing and it's the first day I'm trying this um, car vlogging thing. I don't know, I just put my camera on the dashboard and that's it. Um, 
I'm in a red light so I can talk to you, but now it's green, I can drive. So, whoop. <laughs> um, what is this about? Yes, it's not directly wrestling, but it is improving the look of my wrestling. Um, I'm going to get my hair done. Um, so say goodbye to these luscious brown locks with ombre blonde by now washed out green tips. Um, yeah, my hairdresser promised me something I'm very excited about and let's see how this will look. Um, I tried to take you with me, the battery is not that well anymore. We'll see. You will, at the very least, see the end result. Um, wow! Bye, camera! <laughs> and of course, you can see it live if you come to ACW on Saturday. Or if this goes up later, you will have seen it live at ACW. Here is the before, as you can see, my brown natural hair, very dull and not touched up in quite a while now. The ombre is also still there, I decided at one point to just dye it green and rock the green for a little bit. Um, but this is over now, um, be excited, what happens now? Here it is! I am red. I have to say that the camera is not really capturing the actual brightness and how vibrant the color is, but I love it. Sorry, I really do love it. Um, I haven't been red or I haven't had red hair for years and oh my god, I'm so happy with this. I'm so absolutely happy. <laughs> And this is the man responsible for my hair color. He didn't dye it himself, um, one of his employees did, but he was the one who told me that this is possible in the first place. This is Aido, um, the nice gentleman on the right, of course, not, not the one on the left, that's, that's me. Yes, um, Aido is the hairdresser for wrestlers in Constance. Uh, Mero and I go to him for, for years now and yeah, who better to cut a wrestler's hair than someone who is trained and skilled and deadly in MMA and boxing himself? I do. <laughs> okay, and that's it already. Um, this vlog was a little bit different because I was a lot outside, I was in my car, I was on the road basically. So not just a sit down and talk, but me actually doing stuff and talk. Just to inform you how my knee is doing and well, what awesome things I did to my hair and there is one very big disadvantage that comes with red hair and that's it clashing with orange oh my god this looks this looks horrible <laughs> the red and the orange so don't go together well but I only wear my red fox head for the entrance anyway so I <laughs> hope i hope that it will be okay and so otherwise feel free to call the fashion fashion police on me um <laughs> bye I will figure something out. At least I'm just wearing my fox head for the entrance. <laughs> um, 
I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs>